So actually, there's a, there's a guy, there's a guy looking, looking at me, as you can see him, and he's coming this way. Yeah, so there's a guy and he's coming this way. So, um, hello guys, welcome to my video. Um, if you are new to this channel, uh, kindly make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. So today I'm gonna take you on a short trip. Um, when I, where I go to, and uh, I'm not busy. So, uh, make sure you watch this video till the end and uh, share this video. Okay, uh, let's go, guys. Guys, so um, I'm headed out to, to 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 the main road. Yeah, so let's go and see for ourselves. Yeah, you know, like. Yeah, so I, li I like chilling when, um, when I don't have anything to do. So uh, I like cars. Cars are, are a bit therapeutic to me. So let's head down. So uh, we're in Karagita, Naivasha. So um, this is a farm. This, as you can see here, Kamata Road. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a Samaram Road. Yeah, you see, you can see the the, the motorbikes are passing. So this is a kind of walkway. But you can see. This is Amara Road. So, um, if you are familiar to it, you can you can say it in the comment. So, um, this is Naivasha, by the way. This is Naivasha. As you can see, the the, the cactus, the I don't know what you call them. As we call them Jerusalem. Yeah. Let me just cross cross to the just cross to, to to the other side, and we can see and we can see here Naivasha. There are quite many the the Jerusalem. So, um, yeah. So this is it. Yeah, Jerusalem. So you can, as you can see, yeah, as you can see this a semi-arid area. That means that they, they have to minimize their leaves. Let's say you have an off day, um, for example, people go and chill outside because uh, there's no noise. They uh, plus the nature, plus the nature. Yeah, the nature, the nature aspect of it makes people wanna wanna try that area. So as you can see, there, there are no people on this road. But um, maybe actually in the morning when people are going are heading to work, I have, or in the evening, you start seeing people on this road. So I go seven years ago like this. Yeah. So we used to to eat to eat like some fruits uh, out of of cactus. So it's it used to call unguna. That that used to be very sweet. But like this man, I, I don't know. You can see it. Some you you remove it from there and then you cut it. In the middle there is a very sweet fruit inside so i don't know what you call it in, in your in your mother in your mother language so uh, i think it used to be called nguna now that that is the main road this is um this road actually um is the sanctuary road sanctuary now there's a land here where um i want us to sneak so there's a there's a private property here now you will see people chilling Let's head it down. So, um, actually, we, 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 we kind of trespass here. As you can see. We kind of trespass. We trespass here. As you can see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's a trespass because um, it's a private land. But you know, <laughs> man's gotta chill, man. Man's gotta chill, man. But people come here to chill, man. No, no, not we don't trespass doing like illegal stuff and stuff like that. Yeah, guys. So we are actually there, as you can see. Um, th this is the whole, the whole land. So um, we have that which we are we have trespassed. Yeah. So this is the main road, as you can see. Those are the cows. Like the, I think there is a shortage of water. That's why uh, you see the cows being taken to you. the lake. The, the lake actually is somewhere, some, some somewhere. I know you can't see it from here, but it's actually not too far from, from, from where I am. So I want to take a seat there and tell you guys stories. So guys, I was saying, um, we, we actually now had, um, when we came to Naivasha, we actually had our home. So we were living around um, Kongoni, Naivasha. Uh, as you there, we used to, to, to live in peace and harmony. It, it was just a very p good place here. Yeah. So um, till then, we, are, we have never, like... Move away from Naivasha. Actually, that's where, as you can see, there the are cows there. They've been taken to, to drink water. So that that almost shop. Yeah, so, um, yeah, you can see cows there. You can see, guys, those are cows. Those are cows, man. Yeah, so, um, what I like about Naivasha is uh, people, are, people who are here are from different parts of the country. 
from the western part of the country, from the eastern part of the country, from the southern part of the country. Um, yeah, so they, 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 they live in peace and harmony as they work in flower farms. So things actually on days like Saturday, Saturday and Sundays, there are actually tournaments from different, uh, like there are hospitality industries here in Ivashabadu and there are flower farms. So yes, there, there are so many intermatches on the weekend. So you, there is peace and harmony plus um, uh, I would like actually to 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 to, to live in a, uh, in Naivasha. Actually, let, let me be honest. So, uh, but around the, the because there are so many so there are so many wildlife. The the lake, good people, the the the, the climate for me. Uh, I think it's good for me because um, it's not too cold. The climate is, is not too cold, so um anyone can 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 live here. Thanks. You know we have trespassed trespassed someone's land. So the reason why there they isn't malaria here in Ibasha is because um, there are students from University of Nairobi, which is the capital city of Kenya. They came here to do scientific uh, research. Now they wanted to eliminate go, go malaria, malaria cases in Ibasha. So um, actually, what they did, um, they came up with some um, mosquitoes which uh, would feed on other mosquitoes. So actually, ma malaria was eliminated eliminated in that way so tell me in the the comment section what that process is called so i'm um, actually so actually there's a, there's a guy there's a guy looking looking at me as you can see him that he's coming his way yes we, we, we have to, to run away you know it's actually so the, the guy who was um the guy who was uh, looking looking at me like there was a guy who was spotting at me if, if i don't know if you saw him uh, so he has actually gone so we have to to, to move this area so actually guys um, I just met someone we used to go to, to, to school with in high school so um, <laughs> I didn't expect that so uh, yeah I didn't expect that so I, I said hi to him so um, he's gone he's go, he has gone that way yeah, so guys yeah so yeah so we are heading to, to, to where we, we, we were trespassing so guys one thing about me so the, uh, I am very observant so you must be very observant like Overall, in your, even in your life, you must be very observant. So yeah, we have to, to to move out here. We don't know who's who's planning what. Like I don't know, but there there are, there is no like uh, insecurity cases around here. And we are going again to to, to trespass this area. So actually, you know, sometimes you have to, to get out because if you're caught there and it's it's a it's a land which you're not supposed to trespass. Yeah. So this they they used, they used to be um. So this road actually leads us to a place called Kiwanja Andege. Kiwanja Andege. So if you know Kiwanja Andege, kindly comment there. So basically, where mostly I come to chill when uh, I I am not busy, I am not working. So um, I come to to, to watch cars. So cars, uh, as I said, are therapeutic for me. Yeah. So guys, we're heading to the to the air aircraft aircraft or I don't know. So comment in there. Yeah, so I'm gonna show you where they used to land planes, but now they they, they normally don't land. So this actually right now is actually uh, used by by cars, yeah, by vehicles, so by, by public transport and stuff like that. So personal vehicles, motorbikes, um, and people. Yeah, unless a few kilometers from from here, there's there's actually a flower farm where they spot their flowers. Yeah, so they are aeroplanes. You will see some. Yeah, feel free to share anything, man. This is my first video, you know, and thank you for you. I, I have eight subscribers. I can't thank you all, man. Like, that's a, a big achievement, you know. Like, eight subscribers is not easy, man. Ah, it's not easy. I had to, to, I had to cross around that area. So, there is actually, as you can see, this road is actually good constructed. It's, it's, it's a maram road, but you can see there, it's, it's well built. Not to that extent, but um, cars, vehicles pass th pass through there. So you can see there are water channels. So the water doesn't get to to destroy our roads because there's a uh, there's a water channel here. You can see, guys. We we are, we, are, we have reached to, to the to the end of, of of this road, as you can see here. If you're familiar to this building, kindly co share your comment there. So this is actually Kiwanja and Ege, as I said earlier. So um, we are actually crossing. We are actually headed to the top still. 
so as you can see we are headed to the top yeah so this is the church i think it was built years ago so to tell me what you think about about this church as you can see here it's called i don't know it's called saint saint joseph saint joseph husband of mary yeah so we are headed to the small airport for now it is not an airport yeah so actually as you can see uh, the shops here so actually there, there is a lot of dust in this area so uh, as you can see guys this is the this is used to be an, 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 an a landing space for for aircraft as you can see here as you can see uh believe me or not uh, airplanes used to land here so uh, as you can see as you, this this whole place you see from from there let me actually zoom this this whole place this whole place you can see used to uh, so it's called kiwanja ndege yeah so yeah guys that's it for today kindly subscribe uh kindly subscribe if you are new to the channel so my name is sheriff um subscribe like comment